In this video I'm going to show you how you can do linear interpolation on a Casio ClassWiz calculator and in this video we're going to focus on solving a worked example. So the question is what is the temperature T at a time of T equals 4 seconds? So on the left hand side of the table we've got some time values and then we've got some temperature values. We've got 1, 3 and 5 for the time but we want to work out what it would be at time equals 4 so between those two readings. And this calculator is actually able to do that as a linear interpolation calculation and work out what the number would be between there. And you do this by first putting your calculator into the stats mode. So you press menu and then you're looking for option 6 so you can press number 6 and that puts you into statistics. Because we're doing linear interpolation you want to be choosing the one that looks like the equation of a line. So we've got y equals a plus bx looks like the equation of a line so we press 2 we're now into the right mode. We now need to enter the data, so we've got 1, then we've got 3, then we've got 5, and then we can go back up and override all these zeros with 10, 15, and then 20. So our x is referring to our time, and then y is referring to our temperature. You can then press the AC button. This is now saved to the calculator's memory and will be used for the calculations. We now need to do the calculation, and what we want to do is find the value of y when x equals 4, which is basically finding our temperature when time equals 4. So we're going to put 4 in for the place we want to calculate it at. Then you want to press the Option button, which will bring up this menu. You need to press the Down arrow, which will give you this regression option, so press 4. And then we want to find the value of y at a given x value. So we want to choose option 5 to find y. So we've got 4 is the point we're interested in finding out. And then we're evaluating it to find y, which corresponds to temperature. So we press equals, and that gives us 17.5, which is the right answer. And you can see immediately that halfway between 15 and 20 is 17.5. 4 is halfway between 3 and 5. So it's obvious that that's the right answer. This can also do interpolation in the opposite direction. So we might put in 17.5, which is our temperature corresponding to the y data set. And we want to find what the x would be at 17.5, so we can do the same thing. Option, press down, then we go to regression, and then we want to choose the X here, and then we press equals, and it indeed gives you four, so it works. So that's how you do linear interpolation on a Casio ClassWiz calculator. If this video was helpful, please like and subscribe below for more on this calculator and others. And finally, thank you very much for watching.